collect the firewood and we saw this massive spider. Which one the Andrews is? Tarantulas? It looks beautiful. But yeah, it must be poisonous. 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 Today is the last day of our <coughs> camping and uh, you know we came to the place and uh, the very important thing is next time when we come we need these utensils for us to cook. So I'm taking this walking back to the Irular village, the last village and there's a person, very sweet person who will take care of these things for us for the next trip. So till then we'll have all these vessels and the important gadgets and all the stuff kept in that house. So I'm going there and you see around it's a way down here and it's a beautiful place. It's all greenery outside. I'll show you the place around. This is how the place looks. It's quiet green, fresh oxygen and I'm actually enjoying this walk. Black tea with brown sugar. He made with uh, sugar cane, uh, brown sugar. Yeah. Tasting like honey. And this is the house, and his name is Marda. He's the owner of this place, and he takes care of this place. Here is where we come and leave our utensils. So till next time, he'll take care of it. Hi Mardana. Okay, hi <laughs> Okay Mardana, now we Ah right. Bye bye. Bye now. Uh, so now we are walking back, take our bags, and then climb to that mountain. Uh, you wouldn't have seen this person in my vlog throughout, <laughs> uh, because he was busy collecting firewoods, preparing food for us, and Crazy and myself were out roaming around. But his name is Mark Gillen. He's the main guy who brought me to the forest when I was 16 years old. Imagine my uh, 16th birthday was celebrated in this forest. And when I woke up, I woke up in the front of an elephant. And then uncle, his father, Benjamin, brought a small cake and then cut cake in the middle of the forest. So we named him Jungle King, <laughs> Mark Gillen. So he's my best pal from childhood. So yeah. So now we have an opportunity to see this guy because he's very shy in front of the cameras. Finally I got him. My baby, I'm going. See you. See you next time when I come back. I miss you. Bye-bye. Uh, very, very important thing is don't expect anything in the forest to be luxury or thing because you see this house. This is where I stayed. And uh, also come with friends, um, uh, known friends who knows this place where you're going so that they'll support you they'll teach you don't go to a new place and get lost it's also adventurous but then it's good to have a people around you who know something about the place and uh, don't come with friends like this who are sitting and working in the forest like okay please no guys don't come this guy <laughs> is finding network somewhere and working here heavily and you see that setup keyboard is there he brought all this from the city just kidding but yeah be with uh, your friends and you can have a good time. Bye bye to this beautiful resort. Guys, let's move on. Yes. Let's go to Konor and Oti. Uh, bye, bye, bye bye to this beautiful bye bye resort, <laughs> which we, I can't imagine. I can't imagine that they were staying here, but it was fantastic. I love it. Now we are going uphill and then towards the city.
Check out this view. It's not easy to walk on this terrain. It's been long walking in this kind of terrain. I've been used to desert so many years. I got so much of insect bites, I have to check out. It's scratching everywhere. Finally, we are up the mountain. And that's the end of our four days jungle trek. Crazy boy, thank you so much. Incredible trek. <laughs> the scene is we are still in the borders of Taos jungle, but we are going to Uti. Um, the roads are a little bad, but still the main road. And after that, it's going to be fine. I'm just waiting to have a nice cup of coffee and some snacks because we are dry for four days. These roads are really bad. Just took it. Avoid this. He is expert in riding these type of roads. My mom told me to buy some flowers uh, for New Year Nights Eve decorating the altar. So we are buying some flowers. Alright, we got the flowers. Now this goes to Koyamato. Mark, you can you keep this in the back on top? So Marky will help me to bring this flower safe home. Now we're gonna load my pulsa down to go Kunur.
finally from Oti to Koyamato, the ride is over. Creswell McCoy, that's your face, man. Yeah. There is he from the forest to Koyamato. Thanks for sticking on with us from Oti to Koyamato. I'll meet you in the next vlog. See y'all. Take care.